and welcome to my channel, Home of Many Blessings. If you're new here, I'm a homeschooling mama to 11 kiddos, and in this video, we are all headed to Great Wolf Lodge in Kansas City, Kansas. This is the second Great Wolf Lodge we have stayed at, and for the next few days, we are meeting up with some family that we don't get to see very often. So this stay should be lots of fun. This is the entrance to the lodge, and while my husband checks us all in, me and the kiddos are going to check out one of the gift shops here at the lodge. We all got a pair of wolf ears with our stay. You can also purchase pup, paw, and wolf passes, which has a collection of different things and events that you can do with your kids on each one. This is our room for my family. We stayed in the Deluxe Wolf Den Suite, which had three queen beds and two full-size sofa sleepers, a cave-themed sleeping area for the kiddos with a bunk bed, two TVs, two fridges, and two microwaves. It cost us a little over $1,400 for three nights. Checkout time was by 11, check-in time was anytime after four. Once we got settled in, we got everyone's bands on, which also opens our door to our room. Got my little one in my wrap, got our wolf ears on, then we headed down to get some dinner.
they have two places to eat on the main lobby, a cute little pizza spot called Hungry as a Wolf, and a more sit down with buffet and bar restaurant style called Camp Critters. We ended up getting pizza for now and also came down to eat their breakfast buffet the next three mornings. They had plenty of tables plus an omelet bar and right beside our large family sized table was a window that overlooked the indoor water park. Once it opened up, we headed straight there. While my older kiddos rode the bigger slides like Alberta Falls and the Triple Twist, me and my littles played in the kiddie swimming pool beside Fort McKenzie. They also had a lazy river called Crooked Creek, plenty of water slides for the littles, and a hot springs hot tub which was one of my favorite areas to be in. Of course, we went to the water park several times during our stay, but we also checked out the Northern Lights Arcade and Laser Tag. Even my littles five and seven year olds were able to play. I think five people could go in and play at one time. We had one of our vests quit working on us towards the end of our stay, but overall super fun. I can't even remember how many times we went back. We had lots of family with us during the trip, so we also checked out the candy shop and of course all the gift shops. 
The stuffed animals and the cute bear slippers are always some fan favorites. They also had plenty of clothes gear and swimming shoes to choose from. In one of the gift shops, they had an Oliver's mining activity that you could do with your kiddos. They also had Howl in One Mini Golf, which we played a few different times during our stay. All the kiddos and adults had fun and even the weather was great. My little daughter loved this huge green frog and kept trying to stay with it, so we had to get a picture or two with him before we could leave. Great Wolf also has Magic Quests. This is where your kiddos get a magic wand and go on an adventure collecting magical ruins and facing the wrath of the dragon. The staff was very kid friendly and had lots of other activities such as craft time down in the main lobby. We made bunnies and colored. One time they had yoga for the littles. That was so cute. We definitely made it to all the dance parties. It's Violet! Hey, Violet's down there! And had to take pictures with the Great Wolf Lodge characters. The wolf named Violet being one of our favorites. It was finally time to pack up and head home. We had so much fun and can't wait to go back to Great Wolf Lodge. Like I said earlier, this is the second lodge we've been to, one in Wisconsin Dells and one here in KC. Comment below if you've been to a Great Wolf Lodge before and where at. We would love for you to subscribe to our channel and like this video if you like this type of content. Thanks for watching.